And who loves you? And who do you love? Evening and welcome to how we all doing tonight. Good to see ya. Boy, oh boy, so we finally got a beer blog rolling, yeah. I didn't do one last week, and I got more comments uh, when I don't do one than compared to when I do one. I was so busy last week with Halloween. I uh, had to go out and didn't need to wear a mask. Yeah, we all saw that. Okay, tonight's beer, we have Rhyme and Reason Extra Pale Ale. Okay, this was done by, was done by Collective Arts of Brewing in Hamilton. This is an interesting type of, interesting type of brewery. Uh, craft brews, which we really support on this show, uh, sort of an art form and this particular brewery is a craft brewery, but they also support up-and-coming young artists musicians dancers the fine arts people to help these young people get going um this brewery uh they on every one of their beer balls they actually their label actually has a, a picture here i'll show you this one this one's based out of toronto they're big time supporters of the fine arts uh like i said uh pictures paintings uh music that kind of stuff and they help all the young artists get going. Now, another thing is this is called an extra pale ale. An extra pale ale is just an American pale ale. You got your pale ale uh, like this, and an India pale ale. Uh, American pale ale is in the middle in terms of hoppiness. It's sort of, it's more hoppy than a pale ale, but not as hoppy as an India pale ale. So anyways, and uh, for uh, supporting the arts, we're a big time supporter of the arts. We like painting pictures of women with no clothes on. Yes, we do. And speaking of women with no clothes, big brass boob. She couldn't help us with that today. Wow. Somebody up there said I don't pour beer very well. So, so Mr. Judge, what do you think? Is that a good pale little pour? Flawless yeah, it's victory. not too bad. Now, see, it's a very, very dark color. So it's an ale, but it's a little bit lighter in color than a normal ale. It's smelling, I can definitely smell the hoppiness. Using American hops, it's got that sort of that citrus taste to it. Mmm, not bad. That's all right. Now, as I said, it's got a bit of a pine taste to it, citrus taste to it. That's sort of more lean towards the West Coast Pale Ale, but that's actually not too bad. So, now, I'm going to suggest if you, people get a chance, buy some of this beer. You're going to be supporting a craft beer. You're also going to be supporting some young artists out there, uh, helping get going out there in the world. So, it's, it's, it's for a good cause. And it's not a bad beer. Very good beer, too. Very hoppy. So, yeah, that's all we have for time for tonight. Uh, as far as this beer goes, yeah, you know. Some paint, some draw, some sing, some dance. We, me, I romance and drink beer. Jansen out. Some sing, some dance, some rap, blue face. I love love. Some sing, some dance, some rap, blue face.